Hi, my name's Jane McKenzie, and I'm gonna show you an exercise now to work the abductors on the outside of the thigh. So those muscles that come down the outside of the thigh here, these are good to help to support through the hip. So firstly, we're gonna get into position. We're gonna take it into a laying position. So laying yourself down on your side, lengthen the arm out, place the hand on the floor, and the hips are stacked on top of each other. If you prefer, if you find that the hips are digging into the floor, then bend that bottom leg so it comes to a 90 degree angle. So your bottom leg, your foot, faces directly towards the back of the room. From here, we're going to engage through these muscles and how we do this is lengthening. So we pull the tummy in and lengthen the leg away and it just slightly lifts that, that waist off the floor slightly so it keeps it all in line through here. We hold that position throughout the move. From there, taking that leg, that top leg, and we're gonna gently lift the leg up towards the ceiling, keeping the knee and toe facing directly forward. So lift and lower that top leg. So you keep that hip stacked on top of each other, stay connected through the core muscles, lift and lower that top leg. You can either flex the foot and then release it down, or you can just have that foot nice and relaxed if you prefer. So lift and lower that leg, and it's gonna work this muscle all the way down the outside of the thigh. If we want to challenge that a little bit further with your, with your balance through here, you can place the hand on the thigh so that it makes, stops you using that hand for balance so you've got to use these muscles to really hold you in position as you lift and lower that leg. Also, as we lift the leg, we can take the arm over the head. And again, that challenges those core muscles to hold in position. You can keep that arm over the head, hold it there in position as you lift and lower that leg. Make sure you're still lengthening that leg away from you as you lift and lower. And you'll feel that working on the outside of the thigh. From here, we can now circle the leg. So circling that leg round, taking nice circles round. And you'll really feel that starting to engage a few more muscle areas through here, taking it into the gluteals a little bit as you circle that leg round. So the leg's not quite as high, but you'll really feel that starting to work. So you can do that as a combination. So you could do from there, you could do one leg lift, and then one circle round, and then leg lift and circle round. So you're really feeling it starting to work in here. Good, lovely. And then just relax that leg down, extend that other leg along the floor. If you want to, you can keep the legs straight and stack the hips on top of each other. Good. So that's working through the outside of the thigh. 